What's good peeps, it's your boy Edward Toda. Um, bit of a disappointing news, you know. I was hoping I'd get a lot of footage, a lot of uh, crazy shit from last night. Turns out, by the time I got there, people were kind of, um, let's just say they didn't have the attention span that I was looking for. <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, I had like this whole whole set planned out. I was going to do the, uh, if, you're, if you're familiar with Danny Dowartese, I was going to do the, the mathematical trick, you know, the one where it takes like five, four or five people. Um, but, <clears throat> hey, it didn't work out. I did a couple of short stuff, but it was just like one, two, one, two, punch, punch, punch. Like it wasn't anything big. The only footage I even have, because my camera rock, cameraman rocked up like quite late. Um, the only footage I actually have is this one. <laughs> And like you know, it was fun, fun reactions and everything, and it was a it was a good vibe. But I couldn't get any like long routines. I couldn't, and yeah, that was the only footage I got. So, you know, it didn't go to plan. But damn, if it wasn't a lit party. Anyway, I thought today I'd shake things up a little bit. I'll do a little bit of a switcheroo. You know what I mean? And uh, you know, try and see if you guys enjoy this format. You know, I'll, I'll tell you a story um, from when I almost got beat up, but I managed to. Uh, escape the situation with magic <laughs> legitimately <laughs> so basically it was me and my mate uh, Vanya from from uh, you know one of the vlogs that I made no the only vlog that I've done um, and we were probably what like 12 13 like we were pretty young maybe no okay maybe like 13 14 because th I've, I've already been doing magic for about like a year or two at this point uh, and we were just hanging out and this was back in the day when we used to like Go around and just practice street magic on random people uh, and just be like, you know, try to because we want an experience So uh, anyway, we, we went we were out in this shopping center Well kind of close to a shopping center anyway like outside of it and we just hang out and we had our cards as always We always had our cards with us, right? And we're just hanging out we're like we didn't we weren't performing We weren't doing anything. We were just chilling, right? We just I don't know what we were doing. I can't remember but uh this this little Tongan, I think he was a Tongan or Samoan, some Islander kid, um, rocks up and he's like on a scooter, right? He's just like riding a scooter, boom, 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 and we're, we're just like you know talking and looking around, and then he stops, he looks at us, and he's like, "What you looking at?" And, and we're like, "Dude, you're, you're nine, like get the hell out of here! What are you talking about? Like, why why are you trying to pick a fight with like?" Two 14 year olds like that just makes no sense to me, you know, I was like dude. What the hell like what we're just looking like what, What's the problem? He keeps staring at us And then he, he just rides off and we're like that was ve that was very strange Okay, so we just kept hanging out five minutes goes by and we just see these huge Islander dudes like massive and actually one of one of the guys went to my school um these guys were massive, like for, for 14 years old, these guys were probably, I don't know, but like definitely bigger than some adults, like for real, right? And so these guys just rock up and they're like, how'd you been, uh, how'd you been uh, messing with my cousin, G? And I was like, oh no, dude. Oh no, <laughs> like what the hell have I gotten myself into, right? And it's just from this little kid, like trying to start shit. And we're just like, oh, we we're about to get our ass beat. We we're about to get smashed. And I was like, you know, trying to be friendly. I was like, hey, what's good? What's good? Telephony. Like, what's good, man? That's his name, actually. Uh, and, and he's like, nah, bro, bro. Wh why are you messing with my cousin? What, what's your problem? And then he just like keeps coming closer and coming closer. And we're just like, oh, shit. Right? It was just me and Vanya, like two scrawny kids. Like, you know what I'm saying? We were about to get our asses beat. You know, we had cards in our hands. And I just started nervously, like just out of habit, I was nervously cutting the pack with one hand like this, right? And I was like, no, 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 bro, bro, we're good, we're good, like, right? And I was just cutting the pack, doing charliers like this. And then one of the kids sees it, 
And he's like, holy shit, do that again, right? And I was like, what, this? And I do, I do a cut. And they're like, what? Oh, right? And I was like, wait, 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 no, 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 look, look at this then. And I do a spring and then they all freak out, right? They all freaked out. And I was like, okay, no, no, but for real. And then, and then they just like, the, the, the dynamic completely changed. They, they were coming in to beat the shit out of us and then they're like, holy shit. No, no, do, do a trick, G, do a trick. Right, so then I start, I start doing tricks. I, I do the um, a couple of the tricks I did in the in the live performance, um, from from like a couple of videos ago. Uh, you know, I did like a, a few like ambitious card where you put the card in the middle. You know, like maybe like I'll I'll, I'll do it real quick for, for non magicians. I don't know. So maybe you take the ace of spades, right? Uh, you put it somewhere in the middle, just like this, right? You push it in, and then you let it sit for a second, and that's the ace right on top, and that's kind of the ambitious card and you do that over and over in different ways, right? Um, and these guys were freaking out, bro. They were, they were freaking out. They're like, holy shit, holy shit. And I don't even remember what happened to the little kid, like the nine-year-old. Because I don't remember him being there when we left, right? So you probably just like, oh shit, I, didn't, I wasn't able to start anything because these guys are just like, like blowing these guys' minds, you know? Uh, and so, yeah, man, like we've completely got them on our side, like completely. And this was back when my mate was doing magic too. So, you know, it was like, <laughs> it was really funny. Oh yeah. And then at the end, uh, we're like, all right, we're going to go, you know, like, you know, we're like ha shaking hands, like fist bumping all the stuff and we're about to leave. And they're like, oh bro, do you guys want a ciggy? And they're like pulling out a cigarette. Right. And so it went from, it went from like them wanting to beat the shit out of us out of, for nothing, for no reason to like offering us cigarettes and shit like that, which obviously we didn't take because uh, don't smoke, right? Smoking is bad, kids, do not smoke. But yeah, that's that's kind of the story. And you know, that was the moment where I was like, well, that that all that magic stuff was worth it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like two years of doing magic, I, I avoided getting beat my ass beat, you know? So now if you ask me, you know, why do I do magic? Why blah, blah, blah? Well, that's, there you go. <laughs> One of the reasons is because I can completely, uh, you know, Take a situation that's very aggressive and very hostile and completely change the people around. And that's the connection you can create, you know, when you do something that's crazy and when, when you do something that it's unexplainable, people just, you know, it's like cutting a fuse, you know, the, it like hits them so hard that they forget what, what they were even to, like trying to do before, you know. And, uh, you know, this is even better with drunk people, actually, you know, if you can, if you can, uh, because with drunk people, they don't, like, their, their short-term memory is pretty terrible. So they're, you know, like, oh, you know, they're angry, blah, blah, blah. And you're like, bro, bro, let me, sh let me show you. Vanish a card. You know, you're like, boom, you go here, boom, and you make it appear again. And then, you know, that's the whole situation diffused. And, like, yeah, man, like, it, <laughs> that's that's basically what happened. Let me guys know if you guys enjoyed that. Uh, you know, I'm kind of just testing it out, seeing if you guys enjoy that kind of content. If you don't, then uh, let me know, you know. I'll, uh, I'll definitely take the feedback. Uh, yeah, there's not a lot of magic stories that I have necessarily, but I got a lot of crazy stories. So you never know. You never know what type of content I might be pumping out. So uh, you know what I'm saying? Don't be sleeping on me, homie. But yeah, that's about it for this video. If you enjoyed it, leave a like, uh, subscribe. I do daily videos. You know, follow me on all social media platforms, Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, all the links are down below. And as always, mad respect, much love, stay lit, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.